Hi guys, trick or treat. This is gonna be a collective reading for all zodiac sign. I hope all is well with you guys. Don't be staying positive, protecting, blessed, and prayed up, and keep your guy, your guys, all the way up. Okay, guys. <laughs> what a beautiful day. Okay, okay. All right, spirit guys, we got an angel or angel ancestor. This is gonna be a collective reading for all zodiac signs, a general reading for all zodiac signs. So we're gonna see what's going on today for everyone. Okay. All right, spirit guys, we got an angel or angel ancestor. What are the messages for all zodiac signs? For October the 31st to November the 2nd, 2021. Spirit guys, my guiding angels or angels. What are the messages for all zodiac signs? For all zodiac signs for October the 31st to November the 2nd, 2021. All zodiac signs. Spirit guys, we got an angel or angel ancestors. What are the messages for all zodiac signs? What is everyone thinking, feeling, doing, up to, going through? I your mind, your spirit, guys, my God, the angel, or angel, Holy Spirit. What are the messages for all zodiac signs? All zodiac signs. Okay, guys. Okay, let's cut these cards. All zodiac signs. Let's see what's going on. Okay, we got the Six of Swords, right? Nine of Swords, we got the Hierophant, and we got the Ace of Pentacles, okay? And we got the Ten of Swords, the Ten of Wands. So this can be a Leo that's walking away from you, or this can be any sign. Someone's walking away, someone's tired of the bullshit, it's too much problems, too much issue, too much of burden. It's just too much a load on your back, okay? It's like you're doing everything, and you're tired of doing everything by your damn self. So you're tired, so you're walking away. You're going. You're moving on. You're just tired. You can't do it no more, okay? We got the Ace of Pentacles. Money looks good. Money coming to you. Money is coming. Whatever you've been waiting on, child support, inheritance, a lawsuit, okay? Unemployment, self-employment, money that's owed to you. Gifts and surprises. Someone wants to propose to you. Someone's going to buy your ring. Someone wants to ask you to marry them. Like I said, someone wants to help you. They want to reach out to you and help you, okay? Reach out and touch somebody's hands. Make sure it's the better way if you can. <laughs> but, yeah, someone wants to reach out and touch you. Someone wants to bless you. Okay, like I said, you got money coming in. Money looks good or whatsoever. Okay, guys? All right, so whatever you've been waiting on, it's coming. It's coming. Like I said, it's going to be a lawsuit. The inheritance. Okay, this can be you winning a lawsuit. Money, it can be about money. You winning a lawsuit or going through a separation, a divorce or whatsoever or whatsoever. And this could be money that someone owed you that took from you and you getting it back. Okay? Or this could be you taking someone... You could be taking someone to court for child support, the father of your child or the mother of your child. Or you could be taking someone that owes you money to court. It could be anything whatsoever. Who knows? Okay. Someone stressing, worried, up all night crying, stressing, worried about someone, something, can't sleep, missing someone. Okay. <clears throat> Excuse me. This could be someone that's in love. Okay, they're missing you. Someone's just going through it. Someone's just worried, having anxiety. Just, you know, this is someone stressing because they lost the court case. They lost the battle with you or whatsoever. So someone's stressing and worrying, okay, because they got caught up like catch -up. Or this could be someone just stressing and worried, can't sleep, missing someone, going through a heartbroken, a heartbreak or whatsoever. We got a six to swords. So this is someone's moving away. Someone can be stressing, worrying because you're moving away, crying because you're moving away, you leaving them. This could be you moving to a new resident, you getting away, you moving to a new environment, you leaving a relationship, you leaving someone, you just moving away to calmer water because you're tired. Eight of swords. This is going to be a Gemini, okay? Or it's going to be any sign. Someone's feeling strapped, okay? We got the Knight of Pentacles. This is a Virgo. This could be any sign. We got a Gemini. Okay, we got the lovers. It's Gemini, okay? And we got the Eight of Cups, Pisces. This could be any sign. So we got a Pisces that's coming toward you, Gemini, or whoever. 
Someone on some bullshit. Someone's keeping secrets. If someone is not being honest with you. This is a composable liar. This is someone that lies and go back and forth doing the same shit over and over again, guys. Okay, this could be a family member, friend, who was so ever, or ex or someone that ghosted you. And now karma got to their ass. They lost their job, their money relationship. This person is homeless. They've been put out the house. They don't have nobody in their life anymore. they just lonely and sad and out on the streets and looking crazy. Now they're coming toward you, Gemini, or any sign. They're coming toward you for help. Okay, maybe they think you can help them. Who knows? This could be your ex-lover or a new lover or a family member, friend, or who whatsoever that needs your help. Okay? All right? This could be a Gemini. This could be you or it could be a, any sign. Someone's talking about a Gemini or someone's talking about you to a lover, a family member, a friend, whosoever about this person because they don't know if they want to accept this person in the family. You don't know if they're going to like this person that you like or whatsoever. But this can be the lover's new love, new relationship, or someone's in love with two people, okay? Or this is someone could be discussing someone about someone, talking about a Gemini. Or it can be any sign. Someone's talking about someone to someone. Discussing a, 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 a romantic partner or a family member. This is someone just talking. Okay, we got the Knight of Pentacles. Okay, we got a Virgo. Or this could be any sign. Someone's traveling to you. Okay, we got the Eight of Wands. This is a Gemini or this could be any sign. Someone's traveling to someone at night. Okay, this could be a trickster. Someone could be traveling to trick off. Have sex with someone. They'll have sex with prostitute. Or this could be someone's traveling to see someone to get them pregnant be careful because if you're tricking off with someone having one night stands with who whatsoever you're going to end up pregnant so be careful someone going to get you pregnant get you stuck this can be an ex-lover or a friend whoever that you're dealing with or getting up with at night you know what i'm saying use protection because you're going to come up pregnant you're going to come up stuck fuck like what okay this is someone wants to get you pregnant this is someone wants to get you stuck Okay, maybe this person thinks the relationship would be good, all better, all over again. Okay, this is someone wants to get you confused, trapped. Don't want to see you move forward. This is someone trying to trap you. Okay, this could be any sign. We got the two of swords. Someone needs to make a decision about something or someone, a situation, whatever that's going on in your life. You need to make a decision about it, okay? Whatever is not serving you well, whatsoever, you need to make a decision. You need to come to some type of conclusion or whatever about who or whatever we got the seven of swords it's like Aquarius because it could be any sign someone's being sneaky up to no more fucking good moving in silence just trying to take some something for someone just being fucking sneaky a thief okay this could be someone moving in silence trying to get away from you or who whatsoever like i said this this someone's up to no good this is the seven of swords this is someone like i said moving in silence moving away from a relationship this is someone don't want to be in a relationship. They done it. It's over with. So they move it in silence. They don't want to tell you because they feel like they might hurt your feelings or break your heart again or what whatsoever. Or this could be someone walking, like trying to take something from you, steal something from you, being sneaky. Okay, we got the King of Swords. This is Aquarius. Or this could be any sign. This is someone's being cold hearted towards you. Okay, demanding, letting your ass know, hey, they don't have time for your bullshit. Okay. This is someone cutting someone out their life because they tired of their bullshit. They tired of the bullshit. They just tired of someone trying to play games with them, mind games with them, and this and this and that. Okay, let's get these cards going. Six of some, six of ones. So it's gonna be a Leo, any sign. Someone's feeling successful. Uh, someone's feeling like a leader. Or someone's feeling like a celebrity. Does someone look up to you? Does someone? Uh, look at you as a role model or a leader or whatsoever, you feel it successful. So whatever uh, career or project you're working on or whatsoever is paying off. People look at you. You know, they like you, okay? They look at you as someone famous, popular, someone, like I said, a leader, okay? Whatever you do, whatever business, online, whatever you do, but people do like you. They like you, and they see you very successful, Okay? King of Wands, it's a Leo, this is going to be any sign, someone's watching you, this is going to be a false authority figure, a casework, a co-worker, a family member, a friend, or who whatsoever, but someone got their eyes on you, they're watching you, I guess they like what they see, okay, this could be an ex of someone, someone just looking at you, how uh, successful you become, 
Okay, you rising, you like, you know what I'm saying? You shining. It's this is your time to shine. Okay, so someone's looking at you. This could, this could be a foster case, we got a family member, friend, or ex, but someone sees you rising. Someone sees like, damn, like, you know, she or he, they doing it. Okay, damn, we got the tower. What the fuck is that? Okay, so someone wants to bring you problems and confusions. With secrets and lies or so whatsoever. Whatever you do in the dark will come in the fucking light. So shit is about to be exposed. Whatever is going to happen. I don't know. Fights and arguments. Okay. Be careful in your surroundings, your neighborhood. It could be shootouts, game bangers. Be careful drinking and driving. Do you I can pull it over by the police, cops, or whatsoever. Okay. Shit is happening. Things are about to be exposed. Whatever, whoever is saying what. God know what's about who whatsoever. Shit is about to hit the fan, okay? Shit is about to be exposed. So whoever been gossiping, lying about you, saying shit about you that's not true or whatsoever, it's going to come out. Be careful with fire, smoke detectors, candles. Make sure you check your stove and shit like that, okay, guys? Um, yeah, it's crazy. So someone's been back, you know, backstabbing, betraying someone, so... Whatever you do, you do in the dark, it's going to come out in the motherfucking light. So, whatsoever. Okay, we got the four swords. So, someone needs to be careful. This could be a Libra or this could be any sign, okay? Someone needs to be careful, okay? This could be some news about some sickness and illness. Being exposed, someone can have HIV or STD or whatsoever. So, this is some news you're going to hear from the doctor or you're going to hear from someone else. That someone's sick or someone passed away or someone got some type of illness or sickness or something like that. Someone's stressing. This could be suicide or someone thinking suicide or someone wants to commit suicide. I hope not. Okay, if you're thinking mental, if you're thinking illness, if you're having some type of mental illness, please get help. Seek out, reach out for help, okay? All right, if you're going through some type of heartbreak, you're broken heart, you're stressing, you're worrying, Okay, get some help. Talk to someone. Talk to a counselor or therapist or a psychiatrist. Like I said, that don't mean you're crazy because you're talking to a counselor or therapist or psychiatrist. Damn. Okay? So that don't mean you're crazy. That means you're smart. That means you're brave. You're strong. You're powerful. Okay? Because somebody needs to hear this because there's somebody out here that's going through some illness, some mental illness, a loss of loved one. Uh, uh, family crisis or whatsoever. Someone's hurting, crying. So if you're going through some things like that or whatever, whoever making you feel this way and someone making you feel hopeless and worthless and shitless and useless, get the fuck away from them, okay? But like I said, if you need to go to the hospital, if you haven't got vaccinated, be careful because someone's coming down with some sickness and illness, okay? You can be, need to relax. You need to take time off to yourself and for yourself, Okay, but you might get some bad news about some sickness and illness. I hope not, but yeah. Okay, anyway, we got the four cups. So this could be a cancer. This could be any sign. Someone's feeling disappointed, upset about something. Something didn't go in their favor. Something didn't go their way. Someone's feeling upset about a job or opportunity or career or someone just feel cheated and betrayed. Okay, someone's feel hurt. Someone thought something's going to go in their favor. It could be a relationship. You thought the relationship was going to go in your favor. You thought something was going to turn out right. Now you feel disappointed. You feel upset. You feel, like I said, you feel cheated. You feel lied to. You feel betrayed. Ace of Wands, new beginnings, okay? Someone wants new beginnings with you, okay? This can be a relationship, a new job, a new opportunity, a career, a new resident, a new move, a new home, a new start off. Someone wants a new start off. Someone wants to just... Pack all their things, leave all the bullshit behind, all the baggage behind. Someone just want to freestyle. You just want to just start all over again, okay? New, new ideas and things like that, okay? 